There's been much talk on the street of this phantom ox cart that travels up to sunset. But I've heard rather enough of it. Our hands are full enough as it is. I brought the number that you requested. I'll take it, this will be enough. Aye, nicely done. Giddy, you lot. Here's your payment. Thank you kindly, sir. Ordinarily, coin like this would take me half a year to... And I'll thank you to spend it wisely. Don't go dr An ox cart traveling a night is suspicious enough in its own right. If to have known that I'm ca... I know. And I'll take care of it, I swear it. Contact me again when you've need of more cargo. Hold, I beg you. I'll tell you what there is to know. I was approached by a battalion merchant I met at the border checkpoint. He offered me a coin in exchange for... I, I know. Here in Vermin, there's nary a deed more abhorrent. But you have to understand, my gambling debts were like to drown me. I know not where they've been taken. Pray, but here, take this. It is a document I got from that merchant. If word of this should reach the palace, I'd no doubt be... I'll give you all the gold I got today. I swear, I'll ne'er do aught like this again. Wait. This handwriting. It couldn't be. Ah, forgive me. I... Ah, so you've encountered the Phantom Ox Cart from the rumors. To be precise, the letter of the Lord does not forbid the abduction of pawns. However, in our sovereign rule kingdom, crude treatment of the pawns who so loyally serve our liege is an act decried. If one were to sell them for personal gain, they would doubtless be censured no matter their state. And this letter, by its make and the quality of the parchment, I can only surmise tis of the like used in the palace. We ought to assume a member of the court has a hand in this matter. But for what purpose are these pawns being gathered? And where are I have a proposal, Your Majesty. Should we ascertain the pawn's destination, perchance we will discover the intent behind this plot. Yet if we question the driver haphazardly, this mission will be over for it be I bid Your Majesty follow the ox cart without arousing suspicion, that you might divine where it is headed. Alternatively, mayhap Your Majesty could assume the guise of a pawn and await pickup in a likely location. I leave the choice to Your Majesty's discretion. What's this? Only pawns? What's that dullard play? Suppose it's all the same. The car goes all I need to get the job done. In you get then. drink. Could do with a proper meal. What was that? Fine. Now I'm jumping at shadows. We're under attack! Don't just stand there! Protect the cart! Drive the fiends back! Good, you return. I find myself on edge when you... What's the hold-up? Get in!
How fair my fine passengers this evening. Don't know why I'm asking, you never answer. Do you? Suppose you'll just have to listen then. You pawns are a queer lot. They say you'll do whatever the person says. You offer no complaint or quarrel, and you're undying to port. You're well suited as slaves, if you ask me. Truth be told, I've lost count of how many of you I've transported these past few days. Still not the faintest idea what they do with you, or where they take you after I drop you off. I've ne'er seen one of you return. That says a lot. As some would tell it, you're serving as targets for new recruits undergoing spear training. Others say your lifeblood is squeezed out like juice from a grape to be offered to the Empress of Patal. <laughs> Did that scare you, baby? Never mind. It was all in jest. It's not like I know the truth of it, anyhow. Not like I care. As long as I get my coin, I'm a happy man. I'm not fussed for others. Do you know how long you'll be? I only asked so that I might adopt the most effective stance to recuperate my strength. Bolt, we're expecting your cargo. Open up. I hear they follow whatever command they're given. And they'll take any beating without a word of complaint. Let's see for ourselves. Sorry, my hands. How'd you like that? <clears throat> Built rather tough. You going to fight back? They may be undying, but they do seem to ha, know. They're just taking it. Like hitting the that's stuff. Enough! That's valuable merchandise you're toying with. Worth more than your wages combined. Have you prepared the cargo we're to carry alongside them? No. Well, can we? We're off. On your knees, worthless vessels. If we keep searching, I'm sure we'll find something. Wait, you're not a pawn. We've an intruder in our midst. To arms! Has there been some development, Your Majesty? Well, now, you have divined the Oxcast's destination, then. I see. So they were procuring pawns in order to carry out this excavation. The staff you mentioned is most curious. 
It sounds as if tis of the same make as the jewel wielded by the Queen Re I had heard pawns face much prejudice in Batal, yet to hear that they are treated as tools to be discarded. Volcanic Island has long been part of Batal's territory. The lake of lava present there is revered for its flames, which are sacred to them. Perhaps it would be considered blasphemy to give such work to their own. Or could this simply be a means of testing the efficacy of these jewels that allow for the control? I can offer naught but conjecture. For now, we ought to aim our efforts towards proving that a member of the Vermundian court has been selling. Should we succeed, even the Queen Regent herself could not deflect the people's displeasure. Shoot, you have my gratitude, Your Majesty. Tis most valuable. So pray. At last! The score is settled! In the world before...